Got any clients that are in survival mode? As a coach, it's important to remember survival for most of the first world, especially most of our coaching clients, is BS. Meaning that in the first world, we can find food, we can find shelter, we can find water, we can find oxygen, right? Like, we're not gonna die of exposure in the first world. There's shelters, there's government support, there's family, friends. Generally speaking, almost 99 out of 100 clients that you're gonna work with, unless they're flat out already almost homeless, survival is not an issue for them. They might be in survival mode, they're in a survival mindset. But the reason why people get in that mode is that luxuries become necessities in our own mind. I talked to a client the other day who just moved into a million dollar house and he's got all these fancy studios he gets to work in now. And he told me, oh my God, I don't wanna lose this, I gotta go work. And I said to him, you don't have to work. You don't need that house. You don't need those studios. You think you do because those luxuries have become necessities. But if you got kicked out of that house because you couldn't make the money, you would be fine. And he had to agree because he knew it was true. So remember, survival is BS for 99 out of 100 clients. And sometimes you just got to call them on that to get them out of their survival mode so they can go back to their normal, confident, hardworking, and successful self. Survival mode does not help anybody if it's overindulged in and people forget who they really are that doesn't need the luxuries that they've now made into necessities.